WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this Wednesday, October the 27th. This is the Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. update. We're looking at the market up 40 points, 35,798 on the Dow. Uh, it has to go a little way to make that high of yesterday in leg D. 35,892 was the high. It's going to be very interesting. Why? Because you've got a little bit of a difference between the S&P notation and the Dow in that the S&P is only a leg C and we're always looking for that fourth highest peak to the upside and uh, we're at the 45.82 level up seven and yesterday's high was just under 4600 at 45.98 53 days young we'll see what happens here my suspicion is we're getting closer and closer to a leg D in the Dow uh, sorry in the S&P that would probably be a leg E continuation pattern in the Dow and QQQs up a dollar ninety five at three eighty one. That's the index one hundred. Also, just underneath yesterday's leg C could be a peak C by the end of the day. We'll see three eighty two seventy one. The all time high was three eighty two seventy eight. Hasn't made a new all time high yet. It's really, really, really close. IWM the Russell two thousand is pulling back. It's down fifty eight cents. But this is very interesting. The MDY, which is the mid caps, which hardly anybody ever talks about, has done really nice. It made a new all time high a couple of days ago and uh, we're looking at it at 508 down 33 cents you've got to be looking at this gold gold is about unchanged right now 1794 within that trading range look at the dollar and i'm going to get to crude oil in a minute the dollar is down a little bit and uh, still up in the higher ranges but wait a minute crude oil is crude oil really close to turning down you just cannot say because there are many uh, geopolitical forces there it's down 72 cents at 83.94 we're watching this closely because it keeps being repelled at that chapter wave inside track repellent zone and the tlt this is going to be very important the tlt had a big spike to the upside a dollar 26 must have been some kind of news uh, up at the 146.37 level that means yields are coming back down a little but that is a good sign. I'll be back in a moment for my Tiger Technicians Hour. I hope you can be there. It's going to be a really important session. I'm going through 120-minute charts. Didn't have time to do yesterday. It's going to be quite important, at least for me. And uh, check out my opening call, my day news. Today. Great program all the way through today. 11 o'clock, Mary Pesavento, continuing all the way to forward. Tom wraps it up. I'll be back in a moment for the Tiger Technicians Hour.